Hey everybody, and welcome back to another video, another vlog style video of Hard Space Shipbreaker. We're back, episode six. We're doing the things, we're breaking the ships, and I'm vlogging. <laughs> I hope everybody has been doing well. Uh, I am hard at work trying to get these videos up and out. Uh, I actually have finally, I, I talked to my fiance who is literally my savior because without her, I would be lost. I, I'm going to say 98% of the time. She is literally just, she's, she's the brains of our relationship. Not going to lie. Uh, but she had recommended me because I've been talking about, you know, the YouTube content. I've been doing all these recordings and everything and explaining to her, I want to do bulk recording and things like that. And she's like, well, October is almost over. I'm actually recording this on October 29th. So spooky month is basically over. I think the last episode was the first week in the, in the month, in the, in the month, in this month. Yes. In the month. Uh, can I, ooh, ooh. uh, this button. Why is, I don't know why. I don't know what the heck that was. I just heard a really, really weird noise. Anyway. I talked to her and she's like, well, the month's almost over. She's like, why don't you start doing uploads on YouTube? Which is weird because these episodes are going to be so freaking like spread out. It's it's bothering me, but I did this to myself. But, you know, at this point, I have no choice. But she was like, why don't you just start with November? Start start posting your stuff out November. So I was like, I'm going to do it. And I think I figured out how I'm going to be doing my videos. So and, and this is not going to make sense because you guys are going to like see this and just be like, but wait, but it's not October. My videos are just not. <laughs> it's been weird. I've been I've been doing these bulk recordings and these. And these uh, these videos, these vlog style videos, but they're just not going to be in order or anything like that. So eventually we'll catch up, hopefully. But she had recommended, I think maybe for like the first month or two, I might do two of these vlog for the uh, videos right away. Can I get that? Oh, right. Cause that bar up there, right? No. This is the ladder. Aha, the ladder. And then this can go down to the barge. But I think my format is going to be every first week of the new month of one of these vlog videos will be coming out with hard space. And then I will have regular uploads weekly uh, with different games or gameplay series that I'm going to be doing or stuff that I'm trying out and everything. But I think at least maybe for the first month or two, I'll have a vlog video for the first like the first week and the end week of that said month. You know what I mean? So we can catch up a little bit because it's going to be really confusing, <laughs> like really, really confusing. But I, I finally figured it out. And now I just need to. Oh, hi, Indy. And he's sniffing my feet. I need to just get on it and start doing it and stop talking about it because, you know, at this point, it's it's the videos are going to be so staggered, <laughs> so, so staggered. But uh, I hope everybody is doing well. Uh, you know, things here have been pretty good. Uh, Indy is just going to town on my jeans. He's just sniffing my jeans. What are you doing, buddy? You sniffing my jeans? He's like on my feet right now. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, everything's been pretty good. Spooky month is just about over. Literally two, two days until until Halloween. Uh, you 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 won't obviously know this, but I, I, you know, because the way that I did the video is like an idiot. Is this ship done? I feel like this ship is done. Did I disconnect this? I thought I disconnected. Or is it this? Disconnected that. All right, let's let's take care of this big big badonk donk here. How do I get in? How do I get in the bit? Oh, the big badonkadonk isn't a big badonkadonk. It's an engine. Oh my. How do I do the engine again? There's a way that I do the engine, right? Oh, right. I have to race in there. <laughs> I have to race in there and hit the pump. I forgot about this. All right. Let me do this real quick. Here we go. Okay, gotta get in there. Gotta hit the switch. <laughs> Woo! We 
did it. Okay. Shouldn't be too much damage. I would imagine where'd that engine thing go? Engine. Let's just go ahead and just get you on down there. I'm like a professional now at these big engines. Yeehaw. And look at that. Nothing, nothing got damaged. Guys, I'm getting so much better at this. We're gonna we're gonna finish this ship off today, hopefully. Hopefully. Uh flush which wasn't there a thing that said barge? Oh, this whole thing. Oh god. That whole thing can go to the barge. That can go to the barge. Oh god. Uh what about this? Wait, let me check and see if there's any lights, because last time I made that mistake. And there were lights, and there shouldn't have been any lights. There's a light. But anyway, yeah, uh, Spooky Month has been going really, really well. If anybody doesn't know, I think we talked about it last video. I'm a big fan of October. Um, it was my birthday this month. If anybody doesn't know, uh, my birthday was on the 15th, so I'm not a really huge fan of my birthday, but if anybody who was over on Twitch is watching right now, which if you don't know, I stream on Twitch every Monday, Tuesday, Friday, and Sunday. Uh, we had a lot of people come over for my birthday stream. I did a birthday stream on Friday. The Friday before my birthday, because my birthday was on a weekday or weekend, which is weird. I don't remember the last time my birthday was on a weekend. Uh, but we had a little birthday stream and that's because of my fiance because she's a big advocate for me trying to help me with like my content and stuff and she's like yeah you should do a birthday stream and i was like okay so i did and uh it was a lot of fun a lot a lot of love so thank you everybody who came out to the birthday stream but uh birthday was really really good again i'm not i'm not a big fan of my own birthday i don't know why i i i think and i think it's just because i had such grandioso birthdays as a kid that i'm just kind of like I go get oxygen. Don't you go anywhere bad. Last time we had this thing and it got stuck. Oh, please don't get stuck. Okay, I don't think it's going to get stuck. I think we're fine. I think we're fine. Yes, I know. I know. Oxygen. I know. I know. I'm making it to oxygen. Making it to oxygen. Uh, oxygen, thruster, tethers. How do I get out of this? I always hit the wrong button. Tap. There we go. Look at that. Right into there. Right on into there. Yeah, level four. Now we just gotta get to level five. Uh, all right. You know, maybe we should take this out of here. Can we move this? Ew. Okay, I have to carefully cut this out and make sure not to hit those because those are fuel canisters. That's one. Not accidentally hit the fuel canisters okay now we should be able to move this all down to the barge and he's just being he's being so lovey-dovey today really really lovey-dovey anyway but yeah we've been playing a bunch of spooky things and just really living it up for spooktober it's been a lot a lot of fun that's what i call this month spooktober i'm more excited about the spooky games and the spooky season than my own birthday that doesn't say anything i don't know what does but um yeah it's it's been a it's been a really really good month a lot a lot of fun a lot of hype a lot of spooky games and things like that been been watching a ton of spooky movies i think the one thing i kind of regret with this month is that i was gonna do some movie nights and watch some spooky stuff with the community and i just have been so caught up in my own shiz please please oh please oh please yes don't break tethers oh don't break yes yes move into there go please easy okay anyway uh but i think that's my only regret from this season i just didn't get a chance to really uh to do that with our community so i uh, if anybody again from from twitch community from the beard zone community sorry we haven't gotten to do that i will get around to that next year we will watch some spoopy stuff together and have some good times okay what about all of this furnace 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 oh, but then this thing here oh wait this is a this is a panel i can push down eh. And then I think the rest of this can just go into... Uh, if I get level five, I'm just throwing the rest of this in the furnace because I think all of this is furnace. You got about five minutes to fill your boots. 
Five minutes left. Okay. Let's see. Do I get to do I get to five? Crossing fingers. Processing valuable objects. I think the rest of this just goes into the furnace. Hopefully, cross your fingers. But yeah, month's been good. It's been a lot of fun. I'm also excited. I'm going to be doing a special Halloween stream. I'm going to be dressing up. Uh, I guess I can tell you guys now because I, I, this is going to be in, in the future, but then this is from the past. I'm going to be wearing my, my walrus onesie. I, I have some onesies and stuff. I was originally going to be Master Roshi, but uh, due to me procrastinating and just forgetting. Uh, yeah, I forgot. <laughs> so... Please get in there. Just get in there. Uh, so unfortunately, Material yes, accepted. credits accepted. Transferred. Credits transferred. Come on, level five. Okay, we lost some, but we got some more. Yeah, it's going. It's going. I gotta wait till the whole thing gets melted. We're definitely hitting five. And. Salvage goal five. There we go. Done with this ship. Uh, but yeah, unfor I was going to be Master Roshi on stream for Halloween stream. And uh, I just ran out of time to get the Master Roshi stuff since I'm bald now. I, f I was like, oh my God, I could be Master Roshi. Uh, but I ran out of time. So that sucks. But next year, that's going to be my costume. I think that's a great idea. Uh, let's just go ahead and get through all this real quick. All right. Uh, this ship is huge. I'm sorry. I, look how big this ship is. This is ginormous. I don't think I've seen a ship this big. I, and again, I played early access, but I, I don't even know where to begin. I only got 15 minutes on this thing. What the heck? Uh, all right. I guess I'm going to start off with the outer stuff first. So, uh... I did do some upgrades though. I upgraded my cutter uh, and my thrusters a little bit, so I shouldn't have to fill up my thruster as much now. Oh, this is, <gasps> oh, I gotta be careful. That is, that is a cockpit, but you know what? Let's do, let's do a lot of the outside cuts. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I'm gonna have to depressurize in there. Okay, what about this guy? Okay. This is amazing. This ship is huge. It's huge. It's so big. That's what she said. Sorry, I couldn't resist. Anyway, um, yeah, Master Roshi. So next year, I'm I'm gonna be on it. And uh, speaking of next year, Story and I plan on doing a lot of stuff next year. We we plan on. I want to take her to uh, the Salem Witch Trials, um, thing, in. Where the Salem Witch Trials happened, I've always wanted to go and do that. So we're gonna do that next year. I I, I do plan on 2023 being a year where we we do a lot of like go into things and doing things and everything. So that is a that is a goal of mine, big goal of mine to do that for 2023. But um yeah, month's been good. We've been pretty good. Upper Indy, you guys met him. I think it was last episode. I think that's when I talked about it, or the episode before. I already forget the order that these episodes are coming out and everything but uh indy our boy is doing really really good he still is you know he's a puppy so he's still learning some things he's still getting used to uh used to the cat um so there's that um but it's significantly better and um we do need to go take him for the snip snip as i call it he's got to get neutered and uh, that's happening december uh, like it's official, we're, we're taking him in and uh, he's gonna get the snip snip. Uh, so rest in peace, Indy. Uh, let's try this. This is like, oh my God. Why am I using the laser when I can just cut this like this? What am I doing? Guys, what have I been doing wrong this whole entire time? Why didn't anybody tell me that I'm wrong? Huh. I mean, well, this one I can do the laser. This one's tiny. Okay, so I think this outer ring is detached now. Yeah, all right. Yeah, it's detached now. Oh my god, it's it's so it's so freaking huge. 
Uh oh. I might have underestimated this. I might have underestimated this. Did I do this wrong? Ugh, it's it's so it's so hulking. I can't even get this ring out of here. Uh, I think I gotta get this bottom ring out of here, and because then I can just, you know, pull it on out of here. This is this is the real ship breaker. Uh, uh, snip. Oh, I, what am I doing? But um. Yeah, so Indy's been good. Uh, I think uh, as for like updates, um, we talked about it a little bit in my last stream or last video, not a stream. This is not a stream. This is a video. But last video we talked about, unfortunately, my fiance ran into some complications with her work. So uh, unfortunately, her job, she is a writer. And unfortunately, uh, the her old bosses who were nice enough to basically give her this big, big, big promotion. She was a freelance writer for them. And uh, due to some complications with um, with somebody in the company who was the, the editor, uh, basically they weren't doing their job. Basically they were being an asshole. Uh, she got a promotion to be a, the managing editor for the company, which is really, really cool. Big opportunity for her. And then recently her bosses um, just straight up sold the company. They just they just straight up sold the company uh, to a, I think it's an equity firm. I don't remember if it's, I think it is an equi equity firm, but basically a company that buys up other companies and then they try to like spruce up the company. Heather, Le I know, I know. I'm dealing with these big rings, please. But anyway. Um, and they straight up told her initially, like, hey, we're not going to do anything to your position. You're going to be fine. And she was really happy about that. And then out of nowhere, they're like, actually, uh, we're going to de-promote you. And I think this is absolutely insane and super, super unfair. But they were basically like, yeah, we're going to de-promote you and change you from salary to hourly. And we want you to do all this stuff still. Uh, so super, super unfair and really, really scummy, in my opinion. Uh, and slowly the company has just been like dissolving because of this equity firm and it's been really, really shitty. So she's been looking for some new jobs. So if anybody out there, uh, anybody out there, uh, knows of any, knows of any places that are hiring writers, that would be really, really great. I mean, probably by the time that this video goes live, she probably will have found something. But if anybody knows of any places, she really wants to do video game writing. If anybody has any tips or any idea of places that might be hiring a, a writer, whether it's freelance or not, uh, please help out because I really, really feel for her and I feel bad for her about all of this and everything. It, it sucks. Uh, and she was really, really loving this job and everything. So if anybody knows anything about anything like that, please, uh, it would be great if you could leave a comment. That'd be really, really helpful because it's it's been really rough for her. Uh, and it's tough because a lot of these places that do, you know, like with writers and stuff like that, they want people who have experience, especially like, I don't know, she, she's applied to some crazy places like Bungie she applied to. And I might be biased, but you know what? She is a damn good writer. And I know that she would be a great writer for any company, even a company as big as like Bungie. But they're looking for somebody who... Oh, I gotta go get oxygen. I haven't even been inside the ship yet. I'm also gonna pick up some uh, tethers because I think I'm out of tethers. Yep, I'm actually out of tethers. Am I? One tether, almost out of tethers. I think next upgrade I'm gonna do is I'm gonna upgrade my. Uh, I'm gonna upgrade my. Uh, let's see, oxygen. Might as well get thruster fuel and that. Now I got more tethers. I'm gonna upgrade my O2 because now my O2 is bleeding faster than my my thruster. I'd rather it be the same, so we're gonna upgrade that next. Uh, what was I saying? I don't even remember. This ship is just huge. Like, while well, while power washer is very very soothing, just flying around in space cutting. I know I've I've said this multiple episodes, but I'll say it again. This is also just really really freaking cool. Okay, get all these cutting points out and then we'll figure out what goes where. I'd like to 
take apart this rib cage I'm calling it the space ship rib cage okay thank goodness i upgraded my cutter here because this is insane that's cut that's cut that's cut Ugh. a few okay I think that's all the cuts that I need to make in here I think a lot of this is just going straight into the trash just fly on the outside here let's see what we can grab oh, this is gonna go up down into the barge I think there's like pieces on the outside that are going into the bar. Oh, a lot of those are okay. Maybe I shouldn't have cut all these. Oh God, there's stuff that's floating away. Oh God, get it in there. Okay, easy, 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 easy. It's technically like almost like two ships. I mean, cause this aft end, it's like those satellite sort of ships that you see in a lot of like space movies. Like, uh, what is it? Uh, sunshine, sunshine. I know it's the one where the sun's going out. I love I love space sci-fi movies, but it's the one that the sun is basically being extinguished. And they have the the whole purpose of the movie is them flying to the sun to drop a bomb to restart the sun. Okay. What what am I seeing here? Oh, we we missed these bits up here. Okay. I think I'm gonna have to cut that frame. Because I think this frame, yeah, that frame's in the furnace, and I think the the outer piece is stuck. So I think I'm gonna have to cut it, unless there's like an inside piece, to like let it go. I don't know. We'll take we'll take a look. We'll take a look. Okay, those are all the barge pieces. There might be some sort of inside thing, because yeah, that's solid, and it's like around that, so that's not gonna move anywhere. Okay, let's let's take a look around the outside and see what we can do that's where i cut the front maybe we should go inside how much time we got we have four minutes maybe we should go inside let's go inside wait we actually know real quick let's just take a look and see is this outer ring i don't even know let's go inside we're going inside we're going inside the ship i've decided actually i'm gonna take a i'm gonna take a little sneak peek over here on the outside nothing you know what let's go in the back end first the tiny bit because maybe we can just like maybe there's some kind of release or something like that in there uh, barge. Bada bing, bada boom. Uh-oh. Oh, it's depressurizing. Okay. Ooh, I thought that was about a blow up in my face. <laughs> I thought that was gonna... I thought that was gonna just blow up in my face and just send me flying. Okay, we're good. Okay, what do we got back here? Uh, that looks to be the reactor and everything. Okay, so this is the important end. Go ahead and just depressurize. Is this lead? Oh, I didn't realize this area is bigger than I thought. Let's depressurize all this. Okay, we're good. Okay. All right, I am. Oh. Okay. The battery pack. Beer. Is this glass? This is just glass. All right, let's open this bad boy up. So we can go ahead and take this piece off. I'm gonna go ahead and just start taking apart this back end. I think I am gonna have to cut this bit, like the middle bit over here. Uh, but let's see if we can start taking apart this outer hole area. Oh yeah, we can get in here. Okay, perfect. Let's uh, Let's start detaching it. Let's start detaching. I only got two minutes, so let's do some. The music got real all of a sudden. Why did it get so real? <laughs> Why did the music get so real all of a sudden? All right. 
please get that panel off perfect all right let's go end the shift uh i'm gonna do one more shift and then um i'll i'll, I'll get there and then we'll get back into it you know what this ship reminds me of it reminds me of i think it's in star citizen which i gotta play more of the caterpillar i think that's the name of the ship uh it's basically just like a giant hauler but the uh the control thing is on the side just like this ship and it just it's just it's screaming caterpillar at me i don't know why i also like the name caterpillar for a giant ship but yeah we're back okay anyway i'm trying to think of where i last left off i'm so sporadic with these vlog videos but uh, yeah, Twitch stuff has been good. Life has been good. Puppy's been good. It sucks with story and her job and everything, but I know she's going to find something, something. Uh, and she's been really, really trying hard applying for places and everything. And I'm really, really proud of her. She's going out of like her comfort zone. She even applied for some like IR, like in-person jobs. She would like prefer a writing freelance job and everything. And she's, she's had some like callbacks for some places. Uh, I don't want to mention the names just in case, but... Can I pull this down now? Oh, no. You are hooked onto there. You shouldn't be hooked onto there anymore. Ooh. Okay. Easy peasy. Easy. I think I am going to have to cut those, though. That's got to be a cut. There's, there's no way around that. Uh, but yeah, really excited for the YouTube stuff. Really excited to, to start having this content out there. I mean, this, this content's just been sitting on my desktop, just waiting for me to actually do it. But now I got a plan in place. I'm ready to start putting these videos out there. And I hope you guys are enjoying all of these so far. Uh, but I really like this as a vlog style, just to kind of keep you guys updated on everything. I've also been really excited because there's there's a lot of really, really good games that I've been really excited for that are coming out. Like, it's it's pretty awesome. Uh, some of the new stuff, uh, Plague Tale Innis, uh, Requiem just came out, and I played the first one on stream. Had a blast with that. That is out now, so I plan on streaming that on Twitch. I'm excited for that. There's also Dark Tide coming out. Been really excited for that. Uh, and in my spare time, I've been, I've been playing a whole lot of stuff. I've been playing a lot of Destiny. Actually, hang on a second. Freckled's calling me. All right. Let's see. Oh, God, this place is scary. Not really scary. I'm just, I'm just zooming around too much. All right. Let's work on this back piece and everything. Get this all done. Uh, let me grab these lights out of here. Work on this back piece and get the reactor out of here. It's probably going to take the rest of this, this sesh here. Uh, but yeah, actually speaking about recordings and stuff like that, before I started recording for this, I actually just re-recorded because <laughs> the first one, the first take was actually like real, real bad. I mean, that again, that's just me being critical, but in my opinion, it was really, really bad. I did my first recording of OBS help stuff. Uh, and I think I talked about it last stream, but I actually re-recorded it because in my opinion, it just wasn't wasn't good. I could have done better. So uh, I deleted the footage and I decided I'm just going to re-record it. And I actually did that before. It's basically a how to start up OBS and start it for your very, very first time. If you're like brand new to streaming or recording and stuff like that. And I actually like the way that it came out recording wise. Uh, I will need to edit it and everything. Oh God. Yeah, look at that. Hey, and we're level one on there. Sweet. Get that out of here. That's a big old thing hopefully there's nothing bad in there so yeah i finally got that done i need to get this ring off because there's the reactor and the reactor and the thruster uh, the reactor is a dangerous part because it can go kablooey so i need to be very very careful uh-huh boop all right, let's go ahead and we'll take apart this housing. Uh, 
Bada bing. Bada boom. Oh, that's right next to the reactor. Okay. How does this come off? Ooh. Okay, this top piece comes off. Oh, <laughs> this door is just chilling out here. I'm getting so nauseated. I'm sorry. I'm moving like real, real fast here. Right, let's get you out of here. I think that's good. I don't think there's any things that, you know, let's get that out of here. Okay, and we can probably push this down, or we should push this down. Yeah, let's push this down so then I have a clear access to the reactor. Oh. Look at that. Look at that. Easy. Ugh. Fine. My fuel again. My fuel's fine. I really need to, I need to upgrade my suit. I need to upgrade my suit really, really bad. Also, we're going to level up after we finish this sesh. So I'm excited to see what happens next because there is a little bit of a story here. So that's cool. All right. Uh, bada bang. Oxygen thruster. Oxygen and tethers. I'm just going to buy the whole shebang. Whole shebang. I need to upgrade this suit. Why did that not go in there? Oh, there we go. It just took forever. Oh, I forget what I was talking about. What was I talking about? Anyway, yeah, I'm going to be doing, I'm doing a bunch of recording today. I already recorded the OBS thing, which I was, I really like the way that it came out. Uh, I have some beta stuff to record today, which I'm really excited for. So be ready for that. Okay. Yep. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And boom. Oh, thank God. Don't need that exploding. That music, that music for that always like stresses me the heck out. Uh, let's get the thruster out of here. Thruster, thruster, thruster. Yeah, we can just pull the thrust. I always forget the thruster. We just got a thing. A little drive-by, little drive-by. Yeah, there we go. Oh, is that the whole thruster? The whole thruster just comes out like this now? Just pull yourself out. And then how do I cancel tether? It is what? Wait, why is this? There we go. I had a pull, but that was weird. Thruster, thruster. <gasps> Oof. Oh, oh, oh. Man, I am getting way too good at this game. Oh, did I get level two? I hope I got level two. All right. I don't think there's anything left in this engine thingy. So let's just go ahead and get that over there. Maybe it'll break the glass for me. Whoa, we got to take all this stuff out of there now. I think the right way to do this is by going in here and then just ripping the stuff out and then taking it out this way. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Carter, you're looking at roughly five minutes left in this ship. Hey, level two. Keep on at it. We were out. Some battery pack. Ooh. Battery pack. Well, at least we got level two and we actually are above the score that we actually needed to level up. So that'll be cool. I'm excited to see what else we get. But yeah, content. I'm very excited for the content that I've been talking about for the longest time. I, I'm, I'm not a procrastinator. I'm just, I just want, I just want my stuff to be good. You know, I don't know if anybody can relate with that. You know, it's just like, I want to put myself, my best foot forward. I want everybody to enjoy the content that I'm going to be making or that I plan on making and everything. So that's what I want. 
but you know at a certain point like i've i've been ready to start putting this content out so i'm glad that at least i'm starting to execute on that content uh very excited for that also uh big news i don't know if i talked about this before but i got a uh work thing going on because if you don't know me i actually do work a nine to five job because right now i mean let's be honest content creation doesn't really pay the bills so to speak i'm breaking this window fuck this i don't care oh that was a lot of credits that was a lot of credits uh, but I, I literally couldn't get anything out those doors i don't feel like fumbling around But uh, I got a big, oh, I got a uh, sort of a big promotion possibly coming in. It's still a, a lot of the stuff is in the works for my nine to five. I, I do, again, I work a nine to five because content creation doesn't really pay all of the bills right now. And it stinks, but it is the truth. It, it, it doesn't. And eventually one day that, that that's my dream to be full-time content creator on both Twitch and YouTube and everything. Uh, but I do have a potential uh, promotion coming in, which I'm honestly very, very excited about. It's honestly been a... Uh, 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 come on. In the processor. Are you not going in the... Pro I will be mad if you don't go in the processor. Okay, go in there. Not dealing with this bullshit, no gravity. Uh, so that's also been very, very exciting uh, to just have that happening uh, because I've been with this company, the, uh, the, my nine to five for, for quite some time now. Uh, and now finally possibly going to be getting a, uh, a like a managerial sort of job. Oh, no. Oh, no. Please. Trying to finish this. Get in there. We still haven't even gone in the big set. The ship is so big. It's so big. Uh, let's hurry up. We'll finish off this table, which now, see, look, I can just pull the tables out of here. Get on in there. If I can get like one more thing. I only got about like 30 seconds. I'm not going to hit three, but at least we leveled up uh, to the barge. Get this last thing. Honestly, I think I think next time we jump in, we can literally if I can get that table out of there. No, no, I'm not risking it. I'm not risking getting a, a DNF, so to speak. All right. So next time, all we got to do is just take that table. I think there was a few lights in there that I saw, and then we can just cut that end bit off and just send it into the furnace and we get to start this part up. Hey, progress. All right. I'm excited to see. I'm bringing it home. Weaver, I'm bringing it home. I'm excited to see what, what happens in story now. If there is like another story bit that happens. So let's, let's see. Cutter, I want to tell you, I'm mighty impressed by you. Remind me of me when I started. Oh, bright eyed, bushy tailed. Had big dreams of hitting the rails back then. Bought myself one of them classic armadillo rigs. Named the old girl Beulah, after my mother. Told you about my bad revive a while back. Another case of me and technology not getting on, I guess. Bottom line is, this body just ain't fit for flying no more. So, I want to give Beulah to you, Cutter. She ain't in the best of shape, but she'll do good by you. Hell. Even a few places around the village that'll fit her out for gate travel. If you're so inclined. Anyway, that's it. She'll do more for you than me now. I'm just happy she's gonna be with somebody that truly appreciates her. We were out. Oh, we got a ship? <laughs> we have a ship now? Anyway, that is going to be it for this episode for Hard Space Shipbreaker. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm having a blast with this. Sorry if this video was a little bit sporadic with like my vlog kind of style. Just a lot of thoughts going on. Nothing really super crazy going on. So 
yeah but anyway thank you all for watching i hope you're enjoying this series sorry that it's super super behind i will get it more up to date with as life goes on and everything but i hope you guys gals and pals are enjoying this let me know what you thought about this video and the series so far i'm really really enjoying doing this in this vlog format because you know it's just it's just easy it's just easy to talk about things while playing a game so uh also if you like watching things live i stream on twitch every monday tuesday friday 7 p.m est and, and on sundays at 12 p.m est link down in the description uh make sure you do all the things like comment subscribe it lets me know if you guys are enjoying the video and helps me out tremendously so thank you all for watching and until next time guys gals and pals looking at the wrong camera Peace out. Bye-bye. <laughs>